Nilikuwa nimeenda safari kwa niaba ya Kenya kwanza. Nilikuwa nimeenda kule Amerikani kwa siku kadhaa. Nikaanza kusikia wengine wanaleta porojo ati sisi kama Kenya kwanza hatuko pamoja. Nataka wajione hasla na timu yake tuko kitu kimoja na mimi nilikuwa nimeenda kule kwa niaba yetu sisi wote. Tunaelewana kabisa? Tumerudi tuwaonyeshe kwamba tarehe tisa hawana lao. Na wa Kenya mimi nataka niwaambie kitu kimoja. Na neno hili nataka lilenge wale wa Kenya ambao wako katika mamlaka wana wanafikiri wanaweza haribu kura. Kule Amerikani saa hii. Kule Amerikani saa hii wale watu walijaribu kuharibu mambo ya uchaguzi tarehe sita Januari wakati Trump alishindwa sasa wako katika hali ngumu wanajibu maswali kwa hivyo mimi naambia na sisi wana Kenya kwanza tunaambia wale ambao wanajaribu kuharibu uchaguzi wa Kenya kuhujumu demokrasia ya Kenya please watch carefully what is going on in the United States because those of you who are interfering with a free transition with a free democratic process we shall have the capacity to open an inquiry into your activities and you shall answer to Kenyans why you want to undermine their democracy kwa hivyo wachunge sana na sisi tunasema we are soldiering on and victory is ours hapa Nairobi tuko nyuma ya Sakaja hapa Nairobi tuko nyuma ya Mama Margaret Wanjiro hapa Nairobi tuko na ndugu yetu mfupi yuko wapi eh hey, mbogwa tuko na robo tuko na Kenya kwanza hapa na Millicent Omanga pia mimi naambia we are sure of one thing we are sure of victory what we want now is a decisive victory. Victory is there. But we want a decisive one. Hebu nione kama mtatupatia hiyo ushindi. Tarehe 18 atakuwa rais wa Kenya. Tarehe 18 atakuwa rais wa Kenya. Ruto. Asanteni sana.